State Explained. Connecticut. Connecticut is the fifth state to ratify the U.S. Constitution. It is the 48th and third smallest state, size-wise, and 20th most populated. Connecticut is an Algonquin word, who are the Native American people who used to live here, meaning land of the long tidal river, roughly. The state nickname is the Nutmeg State. Not because nutmeg actually grows here, it's far too north, but because long ago, people from Connecticut used to sell little balls of wood and lie that it was nutmeg. And I guess no one could think of anything else, so Connecticut people are okay being associated with con men. Capital is Hartford, in roughly the middle of the state. Largest city is Bridgeport. Another notable city is Greenwich. Oh, sorry, it's actually Greenwich, but it's spelled Greenwich, and no one bothers to change the spelling to make it correct, but will constantly be annoyed if you pronounce it Greenwich, even though it's spelled that way. Connecticut is part of the New England region in the U.S. and has New England stereotypes like early American history, Irish people, fishing, pizza, basketball. Connecticut doesn't really have any clear stereotypes to itself given that it's the most overlooked state. But some notable facts about it is the state anthem is Yankee Doodle, which is this popular American folk song. And, like, the only state song that anyone knows about. And they call liquor stores packaging stores, which is not confusing at all. Being a New England state, they are considered very liberal and haven't voted for a conservative president since George H.W. Bush. Surprisingly, his son, George W. Bush, or George Bush Jr., is actually from Connecticut. There's surprisingly a lot of famous actors from Connecticut, so here's a list of them. And notable movies and shows that take place in Connecticut include Beetlejuice, Arthur and the Mini Moys, or Arthur and the Invisibles if you're American, Bewitched, I Love Lucy, The Gilmore Girls, A Connecticut Yankee in King Arthur's Court, which is basically the American version of an isekai story with a modern person going back to medieval times. And parts of the Owl House, because Dana Terrace is from Connecticut. But what do you guys think? Do you like Connecticut? Are you from Connecticut? Do you plan on visiting? Do you like nutmeg? Let me know in the comments below.